was uh, kind enough to join us here. Paul, the shooting just uh, was not there tonight. Uh, no, we went in the halftime at 3 for 21. Um, looks like we picked up a little bit in the second half, but I don't know. And they were great shots. We were wide open. Yeah. Shots we normally make, but they weren't falling for whatever reason tonight. Um, so we uh, call for a three-pointer out of the gate in the second <laughs> half. We hit it and hoping to get things going, but it just didn't last very long. Yeah, uh, and it's, it's so ironic. Uh, the first two minutes off to that great start, three of four to start the ball game. And it Is that what like, it was? Yeah. Wow. Yeah, three of four to start the ball game off to that eight to two lead. And after that, the cover one on the basket. Yeah, and like I said, they're all shots with, we'd love to take and with the right guys in the right spot, I thought. But um, we just really cooled off pretty quick. And Northwestern is always uh, no let up. Uh, they shot even better, 51% in that second half. Well, and it was tough on our guys. I mean, they had a hand up in a lot of those shots. And yeah. They went in anyway. So the next step was, you know, just kind of pushing them off that spot. And we just never got to that point. And, of course, uh, three-point shooting is just so contagious. <laughs> it you know, is. We were, we were missing them, and that just kind of fed on itself, and they were seemed to be hitting everything. So uh, it was just... One of those nights we just couldn't get going, and and uh, a lot of threes fell for Northwestern. Yeah, and uh, as a result, uh, all everybody got in the game, all the freshmen, and uh, they had a nice look down the last four minutes of the game. Yep, they sure did. Um, there's, like I said, we got talent all the <laughs> way down there. All right, so we uh, scratch this one. Now you get ready for that uh, long trip to Northland this coming weekend. Yep, it's uh it's our only overnight, so we'll, we'll all get on the bus on Friday night. And so, you know, when we used to do this all the time uh, with the Friday, Saturdays, yeah. uh, the weekend trips got a little bit long and monotonous, but now when you just do it the one time, it's kind of fun. They, they enjoy it. Um, everybody getting on the bus and play some games when you get to the hotel. So it's, you know, when you just do it once, it's kind of a treat. Yeah, and we know the weather's going to be good this weekend, so traveling should be easy. Boy, if you screwed that up for us, Randy. <laughs> we'll try not to. <laughs> Most of those trips have been awful when it comes to weather. Yeah, especially heading up to that country off yes, the lake up there. Yes, we've had some bad ones, and they yeah. just come out of nowhere with that lake right there. All right, and then our next uh, home contest a week from tonight uh, uh, could be a big matchup with Crown coming to I sure to hope town. so. Yep, I sure hope that's a biggie for us. So, all right, uh, Paul, best of all luck right, this weekend. Week. Thanks for joining us. Head Coach Paul Grove with us. The Cougars falling. 95 to 70 to Northwestern here this evening.